My apologies for the discreet nature of this message. This was hardly something I could discuss with you in person or over the phone. It's come to my attention that your peers have called for an inquiry into Operation Ghost Town. I have no doubt that the forces who oppose Detachment Zero will be taking aim at them once again. Now, while I won't beg for your defense of them, I will, however, supply you with more information before the inquiry is underway. Within this drive is a compiled series of videos taken during the operation. This was initially meant for the training of Detachment Zero's blue team, but now it serves another use. As full discretion, while your peers will be receiving this video as evidence shortly, I wanted you to get this earlier, and from me, before the inquiry, not having been clouded by the opinions and agendas of others. I respect your intelligence and ability to see through rhetoric, but I do not trust in the meddling and tactics of Zero's detractors. I'm sure you understand. The following video is restricted to O5 level staff. Only those in O5 level parent may view and distribute this video. Any unauthorized viewings of this video will result in immediate detainment and further punishment as determined in severity by O5 level staff. Brutus 1, this is Shinobi. Be advised, Bishop is entering the target building. Over. Interested. 
Wouldn't move an inch. 10 4, Bishop. Moving to contingency, Alpha. Over. Yeah, I'll okay. call you later. O5 approval just came through. Bishop, you want to tell them what you told me? General Korolenko's death went off better than expected. All relations between the military government and their partners appear to have been frozen. As of this morning, there has been a total exodus of all non-military elements within the Exclusion Zone's compound. IOTA 10's source gives us about half a week at the least before they return. We still don't know who their partners are? Not a clue. Can't even find a middleman between the two groups. Partner or no partner. We still need to know what the General was hiding from us. O5 wants us to perform a recon op into the exclusion zone. Once inside the target area, you'll do a full SSE on anything we can get our hands on. A secondary team will provide an escort up to the border, but after that, as usual, the infiltration team is on their own. If Team 1 should come into contact with anything anomalous, a containment team will remain on standby for when you're back here. Our goal is to maintain a minimal presence, so that means no air support, save for an ISR drone. Comms will be bouncing off them, so don't worry about light of sight. If compromised, you will not stand your ground. Get out of there with whatever means you can. Any questions? No? All right, then. Let's try to get this plan developed by tonight. If you have any mission code ideas, whiteboard's over there. This is Sakari 1 1. We passed Serbruga. Over. Roger 1 1. Go to walk. Shinobi out. I'm sailing from here on in boys. Fuck yeah.
you a blue cook stove. Make some real food. What, our Marie's on real food? Gentlemen, get some rest. Blanche, you're on first watch. Jim. Hmm? I drank doors and I forgot it again. Hmm. Do you think your brain was trying to tell you something? I don't know. Possibly. I always wanted to have gotten there earlier. So it feels. I was like all the problems have already come in around now. There's only any left to stop. It can always get worse. I know. Holy oh, shit! I have a bag of Milky Ways. Shinobi. This is Ikari 1 1. We have passed Medoff. Over. Your copy, 1 1. Over. Roger, Shinobi. 1 1 out. What do you think? She's pretty sure it's not brutal. Doesn't look like it was built yesterday. This looks pretty fucked up. You know, if you think about it, some crazy, cool, mid sized government ship isn't really all that anomalous in this new world. Kind of both of course. Maybe the real anomaly is just Eastern Europe. That's fucking big brain. That large surface, down there in the middle. What do you fear that thing is? They might have something on it. Documents, records on what this place is for that we can grab. What do you guys think about these guards? We could mm -hmm. interrogate them, get some intel. Got the amnesiacs to make it happen. It's amnestics, Lance. Fucking amnestics. A negative. Nobody speaks the language. Stick to the fucking plan. to all Sakari One elements. Got a door over here. Gonna take Lance with me and check it out. Expect weak comms. Over. espresso maker in the mess hall if you want to put your barista skills back to work. Funny. Just remember to photograph any physical documents. Be thorough. If they catch us here, we're not going to be able to make a second trip. What about you, sir? Got any plans for tonight? I'm gonna go topside and try to get a better look at that platform. Roger that. Have fun. Sing 
it doesn't make any more sense up close. No, it doesn't. Lance, you find anything on your end? Shinobi, this is 1-1. One, one. Do you have any traffic on local comms that may explain why we're getting a visitor? Over. Damocles to more Sakari elements. It looks like their partners have betrayed the no-fly zone. But I'm guessing the local military didn't have the balls to shoot them down. Need Sakari 1 to remain at the site and observe any activity related to that bird. Over. position to get audio. Pilots and another guy. I don't think he's a shooter. He's got a briefcase with him. Fox, if we're compromised, light up that fucking bird. Roger that. We're keeping it spun up, so whatever they're here for, it's gonna be quick. not good. You need to get out of there right now. If I move, I'm burned. Yeah, if you don't move, who the fuck knows what will happen? Shit. You, come in. You good? I saw someone move back there just before it went off. Shit. Base, we've got a situation. We're burned. Line them up. Pilots are strapped. Let me see your hands. Don't fucking try anything. One of ours was next to your little pet project when it went off. What happened to him? What happened? He's good as dead. Never gonna see him again. How? Well, if I, uh, tell you guys anything, that's kind of asking for my employers to kill me. If you provide us with actionable intelligence and your employers catch on to it, I'd say you got a 50% chance of getting axed. However, if you don't tell us anything, I can make it 100%. And because of you calling your friends, we don't have a lot of time to make okay. that decision. Okay, fuck. Think we can work together? If you've torn the place up, the intel's yours anyways. What do you want to know? Let's start with this. Who do you work for? What, you guys don't know? I'm from the United Nations. Shit. You're kidding me right now. Global Coal Coalition. Should have figured you cucks are on this shit. You guys made a real big fucking mistake coming out here. I could say the same to you. So you guys are, what, SCP Foundation? Just a couple of friends came out here for a walk. Why is the UN here? What is that thing out there? Good question. Truth is, we don't have a clue. We guessed it was built under the Iron Curtain, but there's nothing from the old government on it. Hell, all the facilities and shit. That's stuff my people built around the old construct. Locals only noticed it last year. Whole thing looks as if it just kind of showed up. Out of thin air. And by the way it functions, that doesn't sound that far-fetched. That shit you saw out there, that's its principal function. Periodically, without us activating it, the ship powers on and warps out any foreign bodies within its area of effect. 
The fuck's that mean? As far as we know, it's like a rift. It goes from one dimension to another. It's clearly man-made, but I don't know how it works. Or who the fuck made it? All we know is that it works. Anything standing on it is tossed out of our reality in an instant. Does it go to ice? I mean, yeah, kinda. It'll fire up again in a bit, at which point anything can return. After that, it closes for another season. Runs like clockwork. What's the military government getting out of all this? I don't know everything, but from what I hear on the grapevine, immunity. In return for our use of the anomalous object, the UN will overlook the human rights violations committed on part of the military government. They won't let us move it out, and the exclusion zone has been put up under the worry that other rifts might come through in this area. But there isn't a lot of evidence to back that up. I'm sure there's a strategic advantage involving the Civil War, but I'm not sitting in on those conversations. Love me some dirty politics. Save your fucking moralizing. You people are no better. You mentioned earlier, if a person can safely enter and exit the rift machine without ordeal, why do you assume our friend is dead? Well, well, that's, uh, because of how we use it. Explain. Okay, so the dimension itself, it's not particularly active. From our limited observation of it, we haven't been able to find anything inhabiting it other than birds, insects, and rodents. It was clearly inhabited by someone, at some point, due to the fact that there's infrastructure present, but we don't know what happened. However, it remains a useful asset to the GOC. Internally, we call it Black Horizon. If you are an informed party, you'll know our mission statement is the acquisition and subsequent destruction of anomalous entities. Well. This is what happens when we encounter that which we cannot destroy. Captured assets are transported here and dumped into the rift machine. If we can't kill them, well, they might as well be pushed out of our way. Makes them good as dead. You dumb motherfuckers. So our friend is in that fucking place with a shitload of unkillable anomalies. I mean, yeah, basically. Can we get a signal through? giving us about an hour until the bad guys show up. 
And the TL? If he heard me, he's in no position to reply. 1-1 one, one is officially MIA. As such, I'm assuming command of this fire team. Pass the word on to Shinobi. Got us approval to extract our new best friend. So, what do we do now? We gonna leave the TL? Negative. You with the men. Door closes in a bit. And it goes two ways. We're gonna make contact with the enemy way before that happens. You make it sound like it's a bad thing. If he comes out of there, and we're not here to support him, he's going to be taken captive. Then what's already a major incident is going to get a lot fucking worse. We don't have a choice but to defend this position until that gate closes. Look, I like the guy a whole lot, but we don't know what's in there. He could be infected. You've got the anomaly manifest. Pass them over to the base and let Tok work it out with the containment team. Right now, we need to get our prisoner ready to extract. Lance, he's your charge. Meanwhile, Pierce and I will move the bodies, kick some dirt over the blood, and deploy explosives for an ambush. Roger that. Oi, where do you keep the keys to the MRAPs? Prisoner secure and out cold. Fox, where you want me? Find somewhere on the left where Pierce and I can support you. Ten four. You know what I just realized? What's up? I was in the middle of watching the last season of The Wire before we started this up. So if I die out here, I'm never gonna know how it fucking ends.
damn it, god fucking damn it. Solid copy, Shinobi. Weapons ready and standing by for Team 1. Over. This is 2-3. I've got eyes on the target vehicles. Ready for detonation. Feeling a bit left out when we give you back. My people could make use of someone like you. A mall within the GSC is invaluable. What do you think? Save it. You think I'm gonna work for you guys? Do you even know what your employers actually want? What their actual end game is? Do you? So many interested parties shaking hands. How can intent ever be ascribed to your superiors? For all their faults. My people are insular enough to keep our ideological framework focused. And my people are legitimate. You're just a fucking outlaw state. You guys act without the consent or will of the people, breaking international law and causing irreparable damage to foreign nations. You are completely without borders or respect for the geopolitical consequences of your actions. But we act with the superior doctrine. You're all the same damage and more, but for nothing. In addition to that, as evidenced by Black Horizon, you remain unable to completely fulfill your own mission goals. Your necessity is refuted by your own actions. Are we done here? <laughs> 